Well, this video is just to explain a bit about the way the hat is designed on this little head. So we'll come back to that bit in a minute. It uses four tactile switches, 4.5 mil or greater, depending on how you want to use this. I use longer ones because I'm, I'm not going to use it with the, the little stick. But if you want to use the stick, well, firstly, before you can do that, you've got to make sure that the holes that these fit into are nice and clean and square at the bottom so that uh, when you look across this, they're nice and flush with the top. Because you might decide that you want to put the bezel on that's there. You might want to glue that on, this little bezel. And if so, well, you want that nice and flat and it don't want it to interfere with the stick if you use that. So the stick... You can just put in there like so, and then the height's right. There's a few different heights included in the files. Then you can use the little plastic washer that's there and a tiny screw and fit that in there so that it holds the stick in place. And the stick will still be able to wobble around and do its job. But that's not my preference. My preference with this one is to use this one that I've supplied. So you print that one out and just push that in to place. It'll click through there and hold itself in. And you'll notice then on the inside that you've got the switch connections come through. Now the, the ones in the center are designed to come together and just be linked up with a little bit of solder on those four points. And then from one of those, take your common. Then the other, one of each of the other two pins on the outside, so there'd be one, two, three, and four, would become your connections for your switches themselves. So I use it this way, is when I'm using a uh, helicopter 145 or H135 or whatever. I've got beep trim for up and down and uh, right and left. So I prefer that, so I use it, but up to you.